Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the third part of our 2003 Clone Wars reaction. Um, so last time we saw Sarge Ventress for the first time uh, as well as Darth Sidious and Count Dooku. Um, obviously she was being put through her paces and this is kind of a backstory as to how she was picked up by uh, Dooku as an apprentice in this version. Um, so we saw that she lost her green and blue lightsabers and was gifted the red ones that we're so used to seeing. Um, we've still got the clones uh, in battle on, I can't remember the name, I don't even know if the planet's been mentioned in terms of its name. Um, but they are still battling there, so it's going to be interesting to see what we pick up, so let's uh, have a look. General Kenobi, our cannons are being destroyed. Ah, so the clones do speak. Oh, it's that land sky again. Mount up. Yes, sir. Mount up. I like it, they've got lances of their own. Everyone loves lances these days in this in this version, don't they? Joust. So, obviously, we've got the big... Oh! Oh, it's Kenobi! Why was he dressed as a clone? <laughs> Still cool. Yeah, fire's not going to do anything to him. You need to cut him down with a lightsaber. A lot of spins there. I don't think you quite need that many spins. Okay, evil laugh is evil. And your lightsaber is now stuck inside the droid. <laughs> okay, why well, isn't he just... <laughs> wow, he's got energy shields on his hands. And mysteriously, I don't know, it's still there. I was going to say. What? He's a droid made out of flesh. I'm on my way. Uh. I like how the speeder bike's kind of got like a clone helmet on it, on the front. <laughs> That's a hell of an entrance. We're set, General. Very well. Let's end this battle, Commander. Again, I've never seen, up until that old Republic trailer, I've never seen anyone, uh, apart from Vader as well, block. Thank you. I am merely a banker. That is entirely <laughs> up to you and your unconditional surrender. I can definitely hear more of the James Arnold Taylor in his voice. Control room 
room secure, General. One can never be too sure, Commander. So is this Scipio? Ugh. What the hell is that? Oh, he's like a bunch of tentacles. But yeah, is this is this Scipio? Because you know the moon's home world is called Scipio, and I have only seen moons on the planet so far. Ugh. He just swallowed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Boom. Use the force, Obi Wan. <laughs> General, are you all right? I'm fine. Seems I've created quite the mess now, haven't I? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, this is very. Now, where were we? The style is very ah, different. Yes. I believe you were surrendering. <laughs> hmm. Oh, here's Anakin in the space battle. Come on, Anakin, surely. There you go. I don't think this um, style of animation cartoon is, you know, suits space battles. A lot of gunfire. Simple enough. I know, I know. Red leader, fire all your missiles across the bow of Cruiser 8. But Commander, there's nothing out there. No targets. There will be Do soon. Now, trooper. <laughs> He's gonna have to dodge all the Oh, fair enough. Oh, the rocket's chasing him. Well, hang on, if they're heat-seeking rockets, why didn't they crash into the ship? Into the cruiser? Oh, I guess I'm not going to argue. It worked. Well, looks like the Republic are going to win. Is that Asajj? That's a hell of a lot of ships they just took out. Even where they're both as bad a shot as each other.
Still not showing us who's in the other ship. Hmm, they got you. <laughs> nice little uh, tie back to. Oh. Increase power to the thrusters, R4. This is no droid pilot. I was gonna say, I thought that was hyperspace rather than like a boost. It's definitely a Sarge, isn't it? She's luring him to. That was two ships. No general. That was Anakin. Yes, General. Anakin, it's under control, Master. You're supposed to be in space leading our forces. It's under control. Under control? I don't think so. Your place is with your squadrons, young one. Not chasing one ship through the city streets. <laughs> He's not listening. Master, this is no droid pilot, and the force is with him. I yeah. Can't let him get away. It's a hair, Anakin. Don't be so sexist as to assume that just because it's a good pilot, it's a man. That ship go. It's baiting you. Jumping into hyperspace. You have his coordinates? Then plug them in. He's not losing us. Anakin. Master, the battle up here is more than one. I can handle this. Do not follow that ship! Anakin, do you hear me? Do not follow that ship! That is an order! Anakin! Don't tell me he's gonna... Sorry, oh my god, the why is he... Padawan, if you... See, Anakin was belligerent, but he never disobeyed an order. I don't like that. Don't like that at all. You have the coordinates. Yes, General. Take a squad and follow him. Hmm. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah. Well, guys, um, we'll bring that part to a close there, and we'll pick it up next time. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously, Anakin's always been a bit of a rebel, but he's never openly, from what I can remember, remember, he's never really openly, willingly, you know, sort of ignored the orders of Obi Wan. I might be missing something, but from the top of my head, I can't remember that. And I don't like the way he kind of did it just so belligerently. Almost as if, you know, he was doing it on purpose to get one over um, on Obi-Wan. So, hmm, some points lost there for this version of Anakin. Um, the space battles, you know, again, they don't look as crisp. Um, I think cartoon animation is never as good for space battles. Certainly it's not bad for the, the ground stuff, you know. Some of the stuff there's, you know, really good. We had the clones speak for the first time, I think. And, um, yeah, I'm assuming it's Scipio that they're on because it seems that the moons are the only people on the planet. So I'm going to assume it's their home world, uh, which is, you know, Scipio. But it'll be interesting. Obviously, Anakin's getting led into a trap. So, uh, yes, we'll see where it goes from here. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, let me know what you thought of this part, and I will see you for the next part.